as the Christian family we remind them that they are called to a life of holiness and fidelity as husband and wife. Let us rejoice with them and ask God's blessing for them and their future children to prepare ourselves to celebrate worthily this Holy Eucharist. We humble ourselves before the Lord and we ask God's mercy and forgiveness. Some Pharisees approached Jesus and tested him, saying, Is it lawful for a man to divorce his wife for any cause whatsoever? Jesus said in reply, Have you not read that from the beginning the Creator made him male and female and said, For this reason a man shall leave his father and mother and be joined to his wife, and the two shall become one flesh. Dear the beloved Ryan Mar and Mylene, you are here today to seal your love with an eternal bond before the church. And I assure you of the prayers of the our of our community that God pour his abundant blessings on your love and help you to carry out the duties of the marriage state. And you, my dear brothers, my dear sisters, may I ask you to help Ryan, Mark, and Mylene with your prayers and accept them as a new couple in our Christian community. And this is my prayer for both of you. May this love with which you are now giving your consent never fade but grow deeper and deeper and deeper as the years go on. God bless both of you. God bless your marriage. Ryan Mark and Mylene, please face each other. Manarapan kayo. In the law of God and in the law of man, you are now husband and wife. Ryan, you may now kiss your beautiful wife. 